Hi, it's me again with Crow Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me these two clip arts, and they're both pretty sharp. They'll trace really good. But they want a heart on the end of this arrow, and they want the wings of Cupid to be a blue. So I kind of played around with interactive fill tool to get that. So all we're going to do, we're going to take this clip art, and it's pretty small already. I'm going to set my nudge factor on three inches. I'm going to go ahead and make a duplicate because I always make a duplicate. And I'm going to go right here and trace bitmap outline trace clip art that I use 99% of the time. You can see it's already done. Now we need to check for white color. They are going to print this on a, a, a shirt. So I'm going to fill that in with yellow and just make sure there's no white order back of page. And you can see there is white right there. So we need to get rid of that. Don't really kind of have to in a way, but we're going to go to object and group and ungroup it. And we're going to grab that white and take it away. Now we can get rid of our yellow box. I am going to left click, right click. And all we have to do is go to the common shapes or, or you might say basic shapes and grab your heart and just make it appropriate size or whatever you want. And then we're going to turn it to make it kind of look like it's part of the arrow. Because we kind of want it that way. Now we need to make it, you could make it bigger or smaller. That'll work right there. I'm going to take the virtual segment delete key and delete that heart. Now this is going to enable us to make it red and the other one black. But we need to segregate the wings from the drawing. So I'm going to take the three point curve line and I'm going to give Cupid a little bit of a curve to his back. So now we can take the virtual or the smart fill tool and we're already set on blue. So we'll go ahead and do his wings. We'll go to black and make him black and we'll go to red and make the heart red. Now at this time, I would probably select it all and right click no outline. Now we can take his wings and you can make them smaller or bigger, whatever you want to do. Interactive fill tool. And we're just going to even that white, but if you're going to print it, you're going to need some sort of color up there. And you could play around with that for a long time and, and get whatever you want. I hope that helped them a little bit. And thank you for watching.